Now here's another cleared off area here of a mound, one of the mounds. Uh, the Great Circle's back over that way. But this is a mound, there's the, the wall is over there, which I have in another video. Uh, I'm walking down here now. Now this is the largest Hopewell mound. The largest Hopewell mound ever discovered. One and a half million bass. You can see here this is the plan of this. And then you hear the impression of a basket that they found. It's right out there. It's the largest. It, it's been leveled from farming. As you can see here, what the an artist's conception of the that other mound was just right up there, and then the great circle's way over there that way. Now I'm standing here, right, the largest hopeful mound that they've ever found. Like I said, it's been leveled due to farming and, and archaeology, amateur archaeology work, and etc. So there's not much of it left, but it was the most profound. And now I'm inside of the Hopewell. Now there was a earthworks that I have in some other videos that are running along that line of trees, and those are original earthworks there. This gives you an overview here. Like I say, once again, the largest, pardon for the bird droppings, but there's a lot of bird activity around here, so uh, I don't have anything to clean this off, so bear with me, please. Artist Conception. Its large size and content discovered during historic suggests that Mound 25 was important during Hopewell times. It took one and one half million basket loads of earth needed to build it all hand carried. Like I said, that's, and here, like I said, here's the, the floor plan of Mound 25. And uh, I have a, a sample uh, video on there of some of the things they found inside Mound 25. Like I said, the most profound discoveries were made here. Thank you for watching this.